from the car. Frankie, say hey. Hey. So you get to drive this time. Yes. She mentioned that the last couple of videos, it was me driving. Mm -hmm. And we kind of fight about who gets to drive. We argue a little bit about who gets to drive. We both like to. We both really like to drive, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but anyway, this video is just last minute. We just decided to mm -hmm. go ahead and film. We got back from the post office a couple hours ago and well. Surprise. We had a nice surprise in the PO box. Yeah, a couple of packages mm -hmm. from Ace Knife? Yes. Neither one of us knew what that was. No, we had to open one of the packages, but I have no idea what's in it because you opened it, but then we realized it's Ganzos. Ace Knife is the Amazon store mm -hmm. for Ganzos, and I think other knives, but mostly Ganzos. Uh, that's okay with me, yeah. Yeah, yeah, so we're both excited about it. Mm -hmm. Here's the only problem. We've got, I mean, on our channel, on our knife channel, right, we've got right now maybe eight maybe 10 videos in line in order that we're yeah. going to do this one just jumped to the top and this one goes straight to the top mm -hmm. this one goes to the front well and what Ganzos. we have talked about with ganzos in the past is that it is a great gateway drug it's a gateway drug it's a gateway knife to get you into the knife collection world they're ridiculously cheap for mm -hmm. what you get for the quality yeah. that you get mm -hmm. I mean, yes, it's a gateway drug, but really, you can use them, and people do all just the time as your as your daily user, as yep. your as your beater, or mm -hmm. guess what, as your fidget knife. That's true. Because yeah. they're fun. Mm -hmm. um, Ganzos are great. See see all our videos over the years. Yeah, they're all still relevant. Well, and a lot of them are still available too, and the price points are all about the same still, like twenty dollars to forty ish, maybe up to fifty. Fifteen. 15 to 25 just looking just glancing through today mm -hmm. i haven't looked for probably i don't know six months or so at right. least 15 to 25 gets you so many options it is crazy and they're good knives they really are it's ridiculous the quality that you get mm -hmm. it just is this is my 745 okay. all right it's probably my current favorite this so, one is still one of my favorites this is the fh 61 and i love this blue color that they do it's so there cool it yeah all right let me how much is that i think i didn't look it up how much is it probably right about 20. yeah not more than 25. it's great my, i still love this yeah my 745 here 25 bucks mm -hmm. yeah yeah well that's, i want to look in there that's that see our old videos but we've got two in this package feels like one in here. I don't know that this is a Ganzo. We didn't open it. Yeah. We just here. I'm gonna do okay. that. <gasps> okay. We. This is as far as we've gotten. We haven't opened these yet. Okay. In first glance, this looks like like a Mora coffee, which is funny because Moras are about twelve to fifteen dollars. Fifteen dollars, roughly fifteen dollars. Mora knives. Yeah. Yeah. So it's kind of similar to that. Show everybody. What we're looking at here it has rubber grip to it it has a little plastic sheath what is the name of it glance of the box the name of it is the g806 oh nice yeah and it's 8cr14 8cr14 it just says 8cr14 okay uh 14 would be slightly higher chromium than 8cr13 so it's we're gonna have i do kind of like the rubber grip on it slightly higher stainless characteristics i guess okay. yeah but nice okay um i'm gonna guess without looking into it i'm gonna guess not more than not much more than 15 bucks yeah okay yeah that's cool okay what do we so got so that's that we love the fixed blades that's great and maybe we can use this um at the cabin here next month at the cabin yeah yeah, yeah. and we'll test that steel a little bit but what we get excited about are the folding knives. I know, I love them. Here, I'll let you okay, let me see. do the honors. What is this? Okay, this is the FH91. The 91? Okay. Okay, this. And not it's sure. in BK, which I'm guessing black. BK for black, yep. Yeah. I'm not sure if we have a 91 or not. Okay, we'll see. You get a pouch. A little, a little pouch. Again, we don't know what we're looking at here. We don't know the exact prices. Mm -mm. Oh. Nice. Look at that. It's a liner lock. Mm -hmm. 
deep carry. I'm just uh, right or left hand carry. It is right or left. Yep, just D two. Which somebody's gonna chime in? China D two. Yeah. Okay. It's also probably twenty to thirty dollars. Yeah, I'm gonna guess. I'm just gonna guess on this one. This one's a little bit bigger. Twenty five. Yeah. Twenty five dollars. Did I put my other knife away? Did I already put what it? What you got? I don't know. Did I put them away? I've got my seven forty five. Mm. What did I do with that? Well, it's knife? okay. It's okay. okay. Just just show the um. What is this? This is the. FH ninety one. The ninety one. Yep. Yeah. All right. Liner lock. That looks like a roughly I don't know three point two five inch blade. Yeah, it's a little bit bigger. That's why I was grabbing my other drop one. point. Oh, see. he's just hitting under here. Okay. Because I was going to compare it to this one. Nice detent. Go ahead. So yeah, you can that's, see the size wise. This is definitely more the Frankie size. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay, let's get in here. You want to open up that other package? Well. Yeah, we've gotten exactly that far on this package, so safety first. Right, there's just one in here. Okay, here, I'll take the, um, you can go ahead and unbox it, I'll take this. Okay, what do we got here? This is the model F759MBL. 59MBL? Five, okay. I'm guessing blue. Blue? I'm guessing. Yes, it is. It's a bright blue, too. Hmm. Okay, this is like... Um, Let's show everybody. It kind of is a copy of a bird knife or a Delica. Ah, okay. Now this particular model... Yeah, this 759M. I'm going to guess 15. Yep. I'm going to guess $15. On the Ace store on Amazon right now. Mm -hmm. It is quite the um, copy of a Delica, though. And some people, you know, that's kind of a hit or miss topic, too. You know what, though? But then, again, today's Genzo buyers are tomorrow's Spider Co buyers. Exactly. It's, you'll get this, it, and then happens. you'll get like a real Delica, too. Because you'll be like, okay, that's cool. I want to get a real one now. Well, and overall, our opinion has just kind of been. If we can get more people, just in general, into knives, into knives yeah. that's just a that's a good thing. Yeah, that's a good thing. But I'm I'm saying fifteen dollars. What's the steel? Four forty C. Okay, and you'll see in comments, um, and definitely chime in. Genzo's four forty C has been good. Mm -hmm. It's been mostly I, I want to say better than it's than a typical eight CR thirteen MOV. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and what I would say about this too is that you can tell that this is. A Ganzo, not a Spider Co. It's not like marked Spider Co. or anything like that. So it's right. not like a full on, you know, copy. Right. It's imposter. Exactly. Exactly. It's, so you know what you're buying. It's not. It's not a total rip off that way. It mm -hmm. is Ganzo. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and it's not the the Spider Hole. No. It's their unique. Can you flick it? Usually back locks, I can't flick very well. No, they're kind of difficult. Oh, I might want to. <clears throat> With a grunt. Yeah. No, I can't. Yeah, back locks. If you locks. grunt, maybe. I'll try. No, closer. I can practice. Back yeah. locks are always tougher to flick, but yeah. nice. Very nice in hand. I'm guessing 15 bucks. Not more than 20. Mm -hmm. Not more than 20. Yeah. Wow. All right. Okay, cool. Well, nice little Ganzo update. I know. That is good. What else do we want to say about them? We want to see your comments. Yeah. So new knife buyers and just prospective Ganzo buyers mm -hmm. uh, can can look and can scroll through and see the experience that you've had with Ganzo knives and the yeah. steel and the construction. And, and the, did it start you off at one price point and then did it make you go up from there? Yeah. Are you buying Chris Reeve knives mm -hmm. now? Are you buying Medford's? Yeah. Are you buying full customs? Right. We see it. We see comments every week mm -hmm. on those old videos on those yeah. 2016 videos for us yeah everybody starts somewhere like that's the whole thing is everybody starts somewhere and like the $20 price point is what is a good starting starting spot and then goes up from there so much knife for mm -hmm. 20 bucks it's just yeah. so much knife for 20 bucks and well you know the other thing too it's October when we're filming this it's uh, late October 
these are amazing gifts. Yeah. Talk about a stocking stuffer. Oh yeah. Yeah. I Check still out. love this one so much. We'll put we'll put links into this uh, this Amazon store for Ganzo. Mm -hmm. But talk about an amazing gift mm -hmm. for somebody. Yeah, it really yeah. is. Wow. Yep. I love them. Yeah, they're great knives. Well, let's see. I'm probably liking the most. That new one. Yeah. Out of the three new ones. Mm -hmm. um, I always. It takes a while to get the numbers. It's the FH <laughs> FH91, the liner lock flipper, with the nice detent. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the, I hate saying it, but everybody's gonna say it. The China D2. Right. Okay. okay. It's uh -huh. probably, honestly, it's probably similar to their 440C in edge retention, which is not bad. Well, you know what's funny though? Hmm. This D2 isn't rusted. It's not rusted? No. Compared to other D2s out oh, there? Oh, uh, so we have, yeah. We have a box of, of Ganzo Same. knives at home and they've and they've sat there, um, let's just say a little bit neglected. Yeah. But they they really haven't rusted. No. No, like other knives have in our mm -hmm. collection that we see. Yeah, like yeah. you'll get like a little speck of corrosion on some random D2s. Mm-hmm. This or one? even or even it's stainless. Not. This one's not. Right For okay. at least um, three or four years. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just saying. Good stuff. It's not bad. What a good time to be into knives. It really is. There's a, so much out there for yeah, you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's just so much for the money. Yeah. Sweet. Okay. I'm liking it. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, that's it. If you made it this far in the video, give us a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe as well. Yep. And uh, like we say, we'll put we'll put, put your links comments in. Down below. Put the comments, your Ganzo experiences, mm -hmm. good or bad. I, yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and say you probably won't see too much negative mm -hmm. for that money. Right. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Yeah. All right. I think that's it. Mm -hmm. well, I'm gonna EDC my Ganzo for the rest of the day. What about you? Okay. I'm gonna still carry this one. He's my yeah. favorite still. Yeah. All right. Thanks a lot for joining us. Yeah.